So at the Emacs conference, people wanted to find out about packaging, how to package files. So I'm going to do a quick screencast on that. It really is very, very simple. So let's change to Scratch. We're going to go and create a directory called package demo. And then in package demo, we're going to create a package demo.el. This is the auto insert mode, which basically inserts a template of elist for me. We're going to look at that in a second. I'm just going to say yes, a short description demonstration of packaging. Keywords so lisp and the commentary is just a simple demonstration of packaging and Emacs lisp file. You can see the package has inserted a whole bunch of stuff. It's inserted this header. Uh, this is important for packaging and it's inserted this very important end header that tells the package where the end of the file is so let's just give this some code package demo with nothing in it oops uh, we'll just spit something out package demo Packaging. <coughs> we can give this a comment. It's pretty easy. Uh, we're going to make this auto load so that when you load the package, this will be automatically available to you. And now we're going to add some more headers here. We need a created header. 6th of April 2013. And we need a version header. The version could be any string, uh, but for these sorts of things, I like to use this combination. Uh, we could also use a git hash or something like that, but this combines the best of semantic versioning and automatic versioning. I like that scheme. That really is all there is to it. So we can now take that file and we can go and upload it to Marmalade or put it into GitHub and make it available through Melpa or put it on the Emacs wiki and make it available through Melpa or Helge or something like that. Um, but we can also install it just like this. Now I've got something open already, we just click that. So now if I do package demo, we can see that it says package demo. And that's really all there is to it. Thanks very much.